the good things you do will come back to you. In fact, what you have on several different things, you don't know what bad things might happen on you. There are things that are certain. If the clouds are full of rain, then it will pour water on the earth. If a tree falls to the south or to the north, then it will stay where it falls. But there are things that, that you cannot be sure of. You must take a chance. If a person waits for perfect weather, then he will never plant his seed. And if a person is afraid that every cloud will bring, will bring rain, then he will never harvest his crops. You don't know where the wind blows, and you don't know how a baby grows inside its father's body. It is the same way you don't know what God will do, but He makes everything happen. So, begin planting early in the morning, and don't stop working until evening. Why? Why? Because you don't know which things will make you rich. Maybe everything you do will be successful. It is good to be alive. It is good to see the light from the sun. You should enjoy the days of your life, no matter how long you live. But remember that you will die. And when, and you will be dead much longer than you were alive. And when you have died, you can't do anything. So young people, enjoy yourselves while you are young. Be happy. Do whatever your heart tells you to do. Do whatever you want. But remember that God will judge everything you do. Don't let your body lead you to sin. Don't let your anger control you. People do foolish things in the dawn of life when they were young. Remember your Creator while you were young, before the bad times of the old age come. When the years come when you say, I have wasted my life. When the time comes when the sun and the moon and the stars become dark to you, at that time, your arms will lose the strength. Your feet will become weak and bent. Your teeth will fall out and you won't be able to chew your food. Your eyes will not see clearly. Your hear, will, you will be hard of hearing. You won't be able to hear noises in the streets. And the sound of the stone grinding grain, your grain, will, sound, will seem quiet to you and you won't be able to hear women singing. But the sound of a bird will wake you early in the morning because you won't be able to sleep. You will be afraid of high places. You will be, you will be afraid of tripping over small things on your path. Your hair will, will grow white like the flowers of a almond tree. You will drag yourself along like a grasshopper as you, as you walk and you will lose your desire to live. And then you will return to your eternal home as the mourners gather in the street carrying your body to the grave. Remember your creator while you were young. Before the silver rope snaps and the golden bowl is crushed. Before your life become useless like a jar that's broken at the well. Before your life become wasted like a stone cover on a well that breaks and falls in. Your body came from the earth, and when you die, your body go back to the earth. But your spirit came from God, and when you die, your spirit will go back to God. Sticks people use to 
make their animals go the right way. Those teachings are like strong pegs, they won't break. You can trust those wise teachings to show you the right way to live. Those wise teachings all come from the same shepherd, God. So some study those teachings. But beware of all other books. People are always writing books and too much study will make you very tired. So what should we learn from all the things that are written in this book? The most important thing a person can do is to respect God and obey His commands. Why? Because He knows everything that we do, even the secret things. God knows everything, all the good things and all the bad things. And He will judge everything people do. Amen. Amen.